Most of the time, if you're making a set of cards, they'll all relate to a particular lecture you've just recently done. So here's a really quick way of getting a bunch of uh, cards together, which makes them a little bit easier to work on uh, across the entire lecture's worth of content. So I'm going to go and select a deck that I have no cards in, and I'm going to add a basic card to this. Make sure it's actually under the type of uh, the deck that I want it to go under. And I'll create a set of cards. I'm going to enter some tags in here to to show you um, how this. Can make things a little quicker. So let's say that the Y1601 is a, a lecture ID. Uh, so I've got card one, we'll add that, and what it's done is it's saved the tags down here, and I can just go card02, card03, and we'll just make four for illustrative purposes. Now I've got four cards then in my list for this lecture. Because I've got them in this list, it makes it really easy to edit across them. So if, I, if I'd made 10 blank cards, then I can go and make my first question and enter in the text relating to that. Maybe I'm going to add in an image, and so I'll pop that into the back of the card and go through to card two and so on. And what you'll find is that it just makes it easier going back and forth to be able to content, uh, um, copy content from one card to the other if you want to. Sometimes it can be useful if you're adding a little uh, note and as extra information, or particularly if you're copying images from one card to another. So you can go to your first card, simply select the image you have in there, copy it, and then paste it directly into here. 